To write the name for K2CO3, the first thing we need to recognize is this CO3 here is a polyatomic ion, and it's bonded to this metal. So we have a metal and a polyatomic ion. It's an ionic compound, and specifically it's called a ternary ionic compound. So to name it, we're first going to write the name for the metal, K, as it appears on the periodic table. So K, that's potassium. Next, we need to either have memorized that CO3 is the carbonate ion, or if we're allowed, we can look it up on a table of polyatomic ions. So the carbonate ion, that's the CO3 there, and the whole thing has a two minus ionic charge. We just write carbonate, lowercase c. And this is the name for K2CO3, it's potassium carbonate. If you're given the name and you need to write the formula for potassium carbonate, you know that this CO3 carbonate has this two minus ionic charge. Potassium on the periodic table, it's in group one, has a one plus ionic charge. So we need two of these. Two times one plus gives us two plus, and that balances out the two minus. So we need two potassiums with this carbonate ion here for our potassium carbonate, K2CO3. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.